Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create unlimited trees in Unreal Engine 5 to make it available in your game project like this. And now you can see this is my Unreal Engine 5 game project here. I have a lot of 3D trees and actually for each of the trees, I can just create it in one minute and it is really easy. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this type of tree Right first, I'm going to close everything. All right, as demo, I'm going to just start from beginning, start from a fresh new Unreal Engine 5 game project. So I'm going to close this whole project first. But before that, what you are going to do is just go to my video description and then get the UE Fast 3 zip. This is a zip file that provided by me in my Google Drive. You can get it first. It is a zip file you have to extract into the folder. Once you extract into the folder, you should be able to get an FBX file. This is the basic one. Get this first. And now we may start. I'm going to start an Unreal Engine 5 game project. Just start from beginning. I will show you step by step how to set up everything actually. It is just in one minute, you can finish. So I will start a new game project, a third person game project. And as demo, I'm going to name this project as demo 12.3. Right, this is just the project name, it doesn't matter. This is just a demo. Now you have this FBX file and the new game project already started. It is loading in just a few seconds. It is going into your new game project. Right now you can see this is an Unreal Engine 5 new game project. If I try to play, this is the Mana Queen avatar. And it doesn't matter for this tutorial, I only want to show you how to create the trees. First, just start a new folder here to create a new folder. Then name this as tree. Right, that's all. Then double click in. Next step, just drag in the tree sample to be just drag in. Of course, you can rename it as well. Just press F2 to name this as tree is okay. So drag in. Then it is going to import as skeletal mesh and click import all. It's okay. Just like that. Next, it is going to show you a message log. Close it. Now you already have, have a basic skeletal mesh. And then the next step, you can just go and collect some of the three PNG. So you can just go to your Google Chrome. Right here is search three PNG. Search like this and go to the images. What you are going to do is trying to get this type of the image. And always remember the background must be transparent. So after you click it, now you can see after it loads, it already loaded and this is a transparent background. So this one can be used, just right click, save the image as. And as demo, I'm going to save it on my desktop. Now, this is one of the example. This is the PNG. So next, your Unreal Engine here, create you see inside the tree folder right click and create a new folder name this as texture now first what you are going to do is just drag the tree skeleton mesh into the map now you can't see anything just because of it is a two-sided it, it is not two-sided now and it doesn't matter now you, you not yet finish set it at least you must rotate until you can see it before we start to set it. Next, in your texture, just import the PNG file that we just downloaded. Drag in. Now you already have a PNG file. This is a PNG file. Drag the PNG file into your tree. Just drag in this way. Now you can see it will generate, it will generate a material immediately. Of course, this material is not yet properly set. So you have to double click in this material 
and then you click the empty part here and you select the blend mode to become mask and then you tick the double sided and then you should be able to see the opacity mask then you drag the alpha to the opacity mask and you're done the setup next just click save and wait for a while now it is saving you may just need to wait for a few seconds it is going to save this material and now you've done the setup already you can close it you can see your tree is ready if you try to play in your game your 3d tree is ready at there already now of course you can make it bigger like this and you can use Control c to copy Control c and Control v then press w button then you can drag it to some somewhere else like this of course now you can see actually at the beginning you just get it from here the google image always select the transparent background of course you also can select some of the the other type of the tree like this choose it wisely choose it properly all right this one also can if it is a transparent background right for this one it is not a transparent background so you don't choose this what about here this one yes you, you can choose this as well right click save the image as on the desktop save it then you can import in the same folder here this is the second picture drag in now you have another picture like this this is a transparent background tree then you can drag it in another tree i say this one i write i control c to copy and control v to paste and i drag it down and then this new texture i drag and drop into this tree and you can see it generate another another map as well double click it and seem this image is not really fully transparent but we can try the blend mode choose it as the mask the two-sided just take it on the alpha drag it to opacity mask and save it if this is a broken image then later you, you may change it to another tree it doesn't matter just have a try you, you never try you never know done you close it now you can see it really become a tree right this is really perfect now how many trees you have you have one two three this is one of the three and of course you can rescale it just drag uh, just click it and press r you can rescale it as well if, if you don't satisfied with the shape you can rescale it and you can copy as well just use ctrl c and ctrl v to copy press w to move it and press press r to make it smaller try to play now you have a few trees already and of course it doesn't have any of the animations this is just just the 3d models that consists of two planes with a alpha mass texture right and now you can see under my images i already collected a few trees let's say this is one of the tree sample as well it is transparent background so maybe i want to try this this two also do the same way drag in now i want to try right here this one control c control v press w button to duplicate one of it at here this is one of the the three sample drag in do the same way double click in take the two sided choose the mask drag the alpha to opacity mask always do the same setup then click save then done i close it you can see it it already immediately generate a tree for me of course i can use ctrl c and ctrl v to make it more maybe i want to get a smaller one now you can see very soon it already become like like a tree forest now i have i have this type of the tree different types of the tree 
you can create a forest in a very fast rate right you can create a tree in just one minute it is really amazing for this tutorial you will learn how to create trees all right so that's all for today about my tutorial on how to create unlimited trees and each of the tree you will create it in one minute in your unreal engine 5 game project you can use it in your game and one thing you must make sure that the png image that you choose must be cc0 at least the creative commons pictures if some of the trees involve the copyright and if you are not allowed to use it please don't use it just choose a cc0 measures it's, it's, not, it's enough or you can just go and take your own picture at the outdoor just take the trees picture and make it become a transparent background images and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3d animation 3d modeling and game developing you can subscribe to my youtube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time i publish a new video tutorial or sharing you receive a notification immediately see you in my next video enjoy happy 3d modeling 3d animation and game developing see you